vlog in the afternoon I'm all dressed up like looking real professional I'm going into Chelsea to do like a waitress trial and interview receptionist bottle service girl so fingers crossed I get the job because it's really bougie place but this is the fit and then I've got little like loafers like this like very English like <laughs> what can I get you madam oh a cup of tea <laughs> But yeah, um, I'm off for a job interview today, so hopefully it all goes well. But welcome to the vlog, guys. It's day, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, day five in London. Eee! So sit back, relax, and enjoy this vlog. restaurant and more in like the financial district tomorrow um, but I really liked that one I'm in Chelsea so bougie here I saw like three Lamborghinis and like people come into the restaurant and bring their dogs and the guy was like oh you're in Chelsea now and I was like oh but yeah super exciting exploring another place in London and yeah I'm just really loving it obviously having ups and downs but yeah guys welcome back this afternoon I just went home and looked for places to live and then Marissa messaged me and she's like I'm coming to Convent Garden so I did my makeup super super quick um, and yeah I'm gonna meet her at Convent Garden this is the fit very basic very wintry but I'll see you at Convent Garden soon what's normal anyway I mean what's normal anyway what's normal anyway what's normal anyway I'm in a crowd and I feel alone. I look around and I feel alone. Is that a never feel like, like I belong. I wanna feel like I belong. And then I just want to like blitz going on share room which is like finding a room in London that's today's agenda let's get started I need a coffee I'm not sure if I'll go buy one because they're seven dollars now and oh it really stings oh I really love a coffee though let's go <clears throat> I also forgot the most important thing I need to do today is call immigration and the TNT People, they're like a delivery company to find out where my BRP card is because I have 10 days when I enter the country to pick this card up and mine wasn't at the post office. I don't know why. So I really need to get on top of that. So I'm going to write a list and tick stuff off today. So let's go. Hello. Hello. 26th of January. I don't know. 
Uh, the 21st of January, I got my acceptance letter. Good morning everyone, it's the next day and I'm just up checking my emails, having some breakfast, I've got some cereal, fruit and yogurt here and then I'm going to have avocado and eggs on toast, but really exciting news, I've just got an email from immigration saying that they've got my inquiry that I've reported my BRP card missing and that I need to email them back with another address so they'll resend it so hopefully today's Wednesday I'll have that maybe end of the week because I really need that to get a share code to give to employees to like show that I have the right to work in the UK because my visa isn't enough because I went to my job interview yesterday and he was like do you have a share code I was like no because da 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 but this is my visa, showed him in my passport, and it's like, they don't know, like, if that's a valid visa, like, I don't know, it's real weird, but that's really good news, so yeah, I don't really know what the plan is today, because waiting for a plumber to come to the, my brother's house, because their plumbing is, like, messed up, um, but I have a viewing for a house in Kensington at 11 that I really want to go to, so yep, and then I also have another job interview at 4.30, but they're also asking for a share code and said that I can't do my trial without it. So we'll see how today goes. Um, yeah, but let's get today started. A room viewing and it was 700 pounds and it was like no living room and it was six bedrooms and a tiny as kitchen so I'm hoping that was just a bad viewing and it's not all like that because that's miserable paying 700 pounds for that so I'm just a cafe having a coffee now and I'm gonna look for other rooms and other jobs while I meet another agent at one o'clock I'm just on my way to my second viewing, so hopefully this one is better, um, but yeah, let's go. So I just finished my other viewing and that one wasn't good either. It was so expensive and it had no living area and like was just like old and everything and now I'm like oh my god do I have to put my budget up or do I have to look out further but if I'm gonna be working nights like I want to be kind of like somewhat close to my work not commuting like an hour at night time so we keep on looking we keep on hustling so I just got home now for my viewings and that was depressing <laughs> um, literally like 800 pounds gets you nothing in any bit of London so I'm gonna have to like sacrifice a lot or rethink things I really don't know so I've got home now I'm gonna make some lunch I'm gonna go back on my computer and look for more flats and then I have a job interview trial at another restaurant tonight and it's close to here it's only like half an hour so so I just sent off my BRP information and like my ticket when I came into the UK for immigration and now I'm gonna have some lunch and then I'm gonna get ready soon for my job interview. I just finished my makeup, put a face on, a black dress shirt, and yeah, hopefully we kill it. Hopefully we get another job offer. We shall see. I'll see you guys tonight. So I just got home. Um, so I went to my interview and it went really well, but I couldn't have my trial because I don't have my share code because my BRP card hasn't arrived. So it's super annoying. I'm going back tomorrow to do a trial. I mean, Jim, 
more house viewings and then a job trial tomorrow. Yeah, so I'm just gonna make dinner and chill out. Dinner here, chicken and rice. Another day, it's 8.40 and I need to run out the door in five minutes. I'm just scuffing down my breakfast. I've got a house viewing, um, which I think is kind of a good one because it's a flatmate, not a landlord. Ow, these are hot. So yeah, I'm going to two house viewings today. I really wanted to go to the gym, but don't know if I'm going to be able to because I've got two house viewings and then a job trial. But um, yeah, we'll see how we go. I'm going to eat Avon toast and head for the subway just finished that viewing and it was actually okay the room was really big there was no living area but it is really close to the train station so if I'm working late at night um, I've got one more viewing now at two but like I'm really like undecisive I'm like do I just claim that room because I know this he said there's seven people coming to look at it at 6 p.m. and I'm just like oh my god I really need a room but it's only available the 9th of April so it's still another two weeks so I'm gonna go see this one at two and then make up my decision then. So now I've come to a gym near the viewing and I'm gonna do a free trial. I haven't been to the gym in a month, so wish me luck. This is promising. This is really promising. There are so many nice cars around here and really nice buildings. Fingers crossed. So I just finished the viewing and I loved the place. It's the best I've seen by a mile. So we're just gonna do a quick prayer because he has another couple of people coming to look at it. Quick prayer and manifest that I get it, that he picks me, please. Can I get that room in Hampstead? Amen. <laughs> Let's eat some mango. We're gonna head back to Shoreditch. So I just got home now, it's three o'clock and I treated myself to a coffee because I had a really productive day and I'm tired. And yeah, I went to those viewings. I went to the gym, which was amazing. I just felt healthy again, got some blood flowing. Um, but yeah, now I'm just gonna do some more house hunting and then get ready for my job trial tonight. But I thought I'd just leave the vlog off here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and you're getting a real raw taste of my start to London life. But I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.